Before we get started, I'd like you to hit that red juicy subscribe button so you don't miss out on any more of our videos in the future. Hey there guys, what's up and welcome back to our channel. You will not believe the luxurious life these glorious mansions hold within themselves. Acres upon acres of land and studded with diamond, polished gold and whatnot. They had us in awe the moment we set eyes on these godly spaces. The splendor they entail, their magnificence, the extravaganza it implies, all of it is unbelievable even if you see it with your own eyes. Here are 10 insane mansions that you must see for yourself to believe. Copper Beach Farm This one made its way to Forbes for an unprecedented price tag it was decidedly sold on. Deemed to be the most expensive home in all of the United States of America, being sold at $120 million, the estate at 499 Indian Field Road in Greenwich, Connecticut, occupies 50 acres of private property, reveling in the luxury and comfort it promises, languishing in its grandeur. The main house alone contains 12 bedrooms that are scattered and shimmers with a wealth of immeasurable degrees among the top two floors alone, along with seven baths and two powder rooms. What steals the spotlight personally is the huge cherry wood decorated and glass fronted library with intricate designs and books of old pearls of wisdom to relatively newer literature. It also houses a garden room, a 75-footed heated pool, a tennis court, and a clock tower quietly ticking away for a century since the first brick was laid in its honor. Crespi Hicks Estate Spreading to 25 acres, its elegance detectable from afar took its sweet time of a decade to be made and renovated under the watchful supervision of Peter Marino. It holds in its estate two lavish guest houses with a mirrored bar room, a theater that occupies an entire floor, multiple kitchens, an art decor bar room, and several greenhouses notorious for the scenic beauty they're responsible for. This mansion remains detached from the clutches of passing time, its design and architecture drawing inspiration from the past four centuries, with each corner holding a reminiscent of each. With its subtle, quiet affair with European architecture, every nook and corner of the estate whispers of its beauty. The Penthouse Valued at an outrageously huge amount of $200 million, this penthouse lives up to the amount with its extraordinary providence of a higher lifestyle. This penthouse has had many mouths agape. The appeal of this penthouse is its location alone. Everything else is a bonus that you cannot even fathom getting. The penthouse not only overlooks the cityscape, but comes with a 24-hour room service where you can just pick up the phone and a devout server will be at your merciful disposal. With unadulterated access to the communal spa, the occupants will have an unwavering means of entertainment and indulgence. Some sources even reveal that at times of emergency, a secret tunnel will lead the occupants to the nearby Mandarin Hotel. Such regards for lives with promising lifestyles has us truly stunned. Antilia A contrast to the slums opposite to it, the Antilia, owned by the billionaire Mukesh Ambani, has a price tag of $2 billion. It's deemed to be the second most expensive residential property right after the Crown's property of Buckingham Palace. It stands 27 stories tall with resources such as three helipads, air traffic control to help navigate the choppers, a 168 car garage, a ballroom which can make any artist envious, nine high-speed elevators, a huge 50-seat theater, green terrace gardens, a professional swimming pool, spa, a 24-7 functioning health center, a temple devoted to their gods, and a snow room that releases snowflakes from the modified, heavily equipped walls. The Skyscraper Mansion is one of the world's largest and most elaborate, extravagant private homes. Aqualiana, a multi-million expense if one wishes to buy this. What steals the spotlight is the eco-friendly theme it was built around. 
Frank McKinney, a famous artist, chose Florida's Manalapan Beach to have his brainchild manifested as one of the most expensive houses in the United States of America. Its sole purpose was to provide unparalleled luxury, but in a manner that best suited the environment. This mansion, spanning over 15,000 square feet, holds within itself seven master bedrooms, each decorated with the finest of things, joined by 11 bathrooms and terraces that look like they're floating in mid-air. A spa that resembles a magnificent waterfall heated with an underwater heating system. The beauty is increased tenfold by the aquarium wet bar. The mansion also houses solar panels that generate enough electricity to keep the entire place running smoothly. But the overall consumption of electricity has been greatly reduced thanks to the environment-friendly features installed. The Manalapan Residence Spanning across 5.5 acres, this $135 million mansion has a tranquil and peaceful aura. An appealing location of the Manalapan Beach, this mansion stands glorified. The residence has a private beach and a boat that stands vigilantly on the exclusive deck for occupants to use freely. The grandeur of the house is apparent through its 14 bedrooms and 24 bathrooms. The entertainment is limitless since it comes equipped with two pools, a tennis court, two wine rooms, a wet bar, an archery range to test the catness within you, a go-kart racetrack, and a bowling alley. All of it seems almost fictional, but it is all true. Xanadu 2.0 Owned by the notable personality and a one percenter, Bill Gates owns his own elegant and sophisticated yet extravagant mansion. Located at Florida's Gold Coast, this mansion has our eyes popped in utter shock. The mansion is welcoming of its guests. Whoever enters its vicinity is provided with pins to adjust the temperature, music of their liking, and whatever lighting suits them best. The guest is open to delving into their preferences. This mansion contains 24 bedrooms, each designed with a twist. A garage that shelters 23 cars with an expected genius level security system and locks with cameras in every possible place like embedded in walls, trees, or stones. All in all, you can't possibly sneak your way in. Additionally to these luxuries, there's also a private beach on which the sands are changed annually, and that sand every year is imported from overseas. Villa Leopolda a French historic monument initially owned by King Leopold II of Belgium, this residence stands dignified over 20 acres of vast ground. With its worth now well over $1.2 billion, it stands detached and isolated and has a significant part of history engrossed within its walls. Used as a military hospital in the wake of the Second World War, this glorious mansion has exchanged hands of royals and billionaires, each willing to lose a major portion of their wealth only to own this. It's also invoked within literature and art for a flair of benevolence. The Pinnacle Montana Standing at $155 million, this mansion has garnered the adoration it rightfully deserves and has been the talk for quite some time. It comes equipped with a ski lodge, houses 10 bedrooms, and each stands witness to unbeatable luxury and comfort. Its magnificence has enhanced a thousandfold for the entertainment it carries. The comfort extends to coziness, given that every room, every corner of the mansion is heated to welcome the occupants and warmth, even the driveway. Fairfield Ponds, The Hamptons A $248 million mansion owned by the billionaire Ira Renner was built in the early 1990s. Receptive of a few controversies and court viewings, the mansion and its appeal remain unscathed. The mansion has between 29 to 39 bedrooms, the number which is still up in the air for a definite conclusion, and between 18 to 35 bathrooms. We've counted 12 chimneys, which imply there could be 12 fireplaces where you could sit and enjoy a book or a cup of tea beside, basking in its heat. It also comes with a 91-foot long dining room, a 10,000 square foot playroom with amenities like a basketball court, 
a tennis court, and a two-lane bowling alley, among others. This brings us to the end of our video, which we hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did, do let us know by hitting the like button, subscribing to our channel, and letting us know your thoughts in the comments below. Also, watch the two videos that are already on your screen right now because I'm sure you'll love them. And with that, I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.